M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Looks like the Yaesu FT710 has brought out their first firmware update dated 11th of the 14th, 22 or 14th of November 2022. And here's the sort of change log that we get. So it's number one, fixed a bug that key up noise appeared when operating in CW mode on 28 megs. Fix the problem that the COM port board rate becomes 4800 BPS when power is turned on with preset on. Fix the bug that sometimes prevented transmission when a linear amplifier VL1000 is connected. Fix the problem that continuous operation or hang up may occur when playing rewind forwarding recorded data while receiving a signal. Optimized variable volume and minimum headphone volume when turning volume knob. Fix the bug that caused a delay when an external CW keyer is connected. Fix the problem that CW transmissions may not be possible with the straight key. Fix the bug that the CW does not work properly when a bug key is selected in the keyer type. So quite a few CW things here. Fix the bug that PC keying did not work partially in CW mode and CW auto mode. Fix the bug where changing the board rate of the COM port is not reflected correctly other improvements and optimi optimizations have been made so okay well we're going to download this and we've hit we've gone to the ASU site i'll put a link in the description here's the file that you get quite a few different uh files here i'm hoping that it's not too complicated to uh do the firmware procedure let's just uh extract that to my 710 file and then we're actually going to have to do some homework here because i've never never operated or performed a firmware update before on the 710 so time to learn so as you know on my channel we all learn together now let's have a look at look at some key things just sd card preparation doesn't look that so number one press the function knob and then touch extension setting touch soft version the version of each firmware will be displayed on the TFT screen. Okay. Downloading the firmware using a PC. So extract it to the SD card. Copy the firmware to an SD card. Uh, previously formatted on the FT710. It doesn't look too bad. How to update. Turn off the transceiver. The USB cable must be disconnected from the 710 Type B. Yeah. Insert the SD card written with the firmware. So insert the SD card with the firmware. Turn on the transceiver. Press the function knob. Then extension setting. Touch SD card. A list of firmware stored on the SD card is displayed. Uh, click update. Indicates firmware to be updated. If the firmware is newer than the firmware in the transceiver and it is not marked, touch the box. Um, there you go. The same version as firmware in transceiver. Broken file, no such file. Update the display firmware number one. Touch the box to mark the tick on the display firmware. If the display firmware has been updated, proceed to update main DSP and SDR firmware touch the tick box mark on the firmware so that's display touch the update to display the update confirmation screen to cancel update touch cancel touch ok to update the firmware the update progress indicator is displayed when the firmware transfer begins update the main dsp so you're going down through it one at a time, press function knob, extension settings. Then you're going down, touch the box, main firmware. Touch the update. So is it in four sections? Or is it three? So anyway, we're going to, uh, I'll put the links in the description for you to read all this. And the links for the firmware. And then I'm going to grab my 710 and we're going to give this a go. Catch you soon, bye for now.